I hope. Okay. This is Toastmaster Refi. Toastmaster Refi, are you here, right? Yes. Okay. Toastmaster. Okay, good evening, everyone. My dear fellow Toastmaster friends and also the guests. Today, my role is as the accountant. My duty is to pay attention to your speaking from the table topic speaker or the prepared speaker and also the other members who speak in this today's meeting. And I will make a note about your non-lexical words like um, um, uh, repeated word and tongue clicks. And also I will make a note about your lexical words like so, yeah, okay, and well, and all right. That's all from me. Thank you, Toastmaster Refi, for explaining the role of a counter. So guys, don't be afraid of silence because silence is sometimes good. We cannot always uh, fill the speech with ah, um, you can you can silence for a moment and then continue your speech. Okay, next is our timer. Toastmaster Alvin from SCPD. Hello everyone, my name is Alvin. I will become timer for this session. So we have four sessions. First is table topic. It is one to two minutes. I will change the background to green when it is one minute. When 1.30, I will change the background to yellow. And when it is two minutes, I will change the background in, to red. And you need to conclude your speech within 30 seconds. And on the prepared speech session, it will be five to seven minutes. Five minutes is green. Six minutes is yellow. Seven minutes is red. And you are about to conclude your speech within 30 seconds. And for our edu session by Toastmaster Michael, it is 20 to 30 minutes. So in 20 minutes, the background will be green. And 25 minutes, the background will be yellow. At 30 minutes, the background will be red. And Toastmaster Michael is ready to conclude the speech. And last but not least, the evaluation speech will be two to three minutes. Two minutes is green. Two minutes, 30 is yellow. And three minutes is red. And ready to conclude your speech within 30 seconds. And I will raise my hand, so I will be on your top left corner, so I will be, become more visible for all you guys who ever take the speech on the stage. Back to you, Mr. D.E. Toastmaster Indra. Thank you, Toastmaster Alfie. Don't forget to see the, the top uh, left corner to see Toastmaster Alfie if you want to know the time of your speech. Next is our ballot counter, Toastmaster. Um, okay, thank you, GE. Okay, um, thank you, GE. Hi, everyone. My name is Purnomo, and um, good evening, fellow Toastmasters and uh, guests. My role right now as a ballot counter is to collect the voting for its speaker in its of the following session: table topics, prepare speech, and evaluation. And please use this QR code to put the best speaker in its session and put it into the scanner and choose your favorite one. At the end of the meeting, I will announce the favorite speaker. Thank you. Back with you. Thank you, Toastmaster Ipung. I think that's all my team. Uh, the control back to you, Toastmaster Resita. Thank you. Thank you, Toastmaster Indra. And now everyone that is from GE team, they will be watching us really closely. But don't be afraid because they are only will be giving feedback for us to be better. Now let's move on to the first session, table topic session. In table topic session, you will be given a chance to do an impromptu speech. Meaning you will be given maybe a question or a phrase that only table topic master and God knows what those are. And then you will have to answer that right away. Well, not very right away. You can think maybe like for 30 seconds and then answer that. 
it will be very interesting. So if you are interested, maybe raise your hands or type your name in the chat box because that will be Toastmaster Ritwan's job to pick any of you to be his speaker. So Toastmaster Ritwan, please lead the session for us. Okay, hello everyone. Thanks a lot, Toastmaster Resita, for the introduction. Okay, how's everything going? Is it all right or is it bad quietly? I hope everything is fine because today we will have some fun things. I promise you, it's going to be fun. Okay, let me share my screen. Okay. Okay, wait. <laughs> okay, I know it's quite old school because I come to the share screen, but it's all right. <laughs> okay, we will have a table topic session. It is like uh, maybe some people ask asking, what is the table topic session? Table topic session is just like a name. The table topic. Have you ever met? Have you ever eat with your family and start to have dinner? And when it starts, it's going to be like having a having a topic where you can talk a lot with them, where your parents may be asking about your opinion about something. That's the, the topic. Because it's impromptu, there is no prepared, and you can, uh, you have to answer it no matter what. So, for today, table topic session <clears throat> is just like our team. Everyone can sell. Everyone and anyone. Okay. Because word of the day is negotiable. Remember, uh, for those of you who do not know what is word of the day, is the word that you need to use when you want to uh, have a remarkable word for today. And it needs to be uh, to learn together. Okay, <clears throat> let's just start. Okay, what is table topic session? First, you will be given a topic to have a speech. Second, it will be only for two minutes. And time will start as soon as you speak, including a, 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 a PC. And it is a fun game, so relax. Okay, how to play for tonight's table topic session? Imagine yourself as a sales representative from ABC company. Your manager told you to sell this thing to customer. How would you promote that? Okay, PS. Notes, you are free to explore anything as staying in the context. PS, be creative, okay? Remember, be creative. You are free to explore anything as staying in the context. Okay, let's just start. Let's pick the number. Is there any volunteer? You may uh, raise your hand, maybe in the offline or online, because we have a hybrid meeting. Toastmaster Asti. <laughs> Asti, would you like to try? Okay. 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 Uh, Toastmaster Asti, are you offline or online? Oh, okay. Oh, online. Online. Okay. Let's, let's pick your number first. Uh, lucky Which number? number lucky you are number going? seven. Uh, sorry? Lucky number seven. Okay, number seven. Let me turn off the screen first because it's just so old school. My laptop. Uh, seven. Okay. Remember, you have to promote this thing. I need you to sell me this phone. The time will start as soon as you speak. So, uh, are you ready, Toastmaster Asti? Oh, wait a moment. 
Okay. Um, you can be as you can be creative as you want. <laughs> you can explore anything, all the features. Mm. Okay, are you ready? <clears throat> okay. Okay. Toastmaster Asti, sell me this phone. I'm coming here to offer you a memory to recall your yet your era when the phone are coming in. So this phone is no longer available in the other company, but we still have to keep all your memory and it will waken up all your uh, youth and all your successful memory during that time. So I will open for any negotiation, but please don't negotiate that much because this is a limited edition and we only come with uh, this model only. So by this, our company, uh, ABC company that uh, will, off, will give you an offer of this and I hope you don't miss the offer because other person also are uh, excited to buy it. This is the limited offer that I came to all of you first before I launch it to the market. So make sure you all of you will uh, use this time of offering that you can quote also your price to me, but the negotiation, the negotiation will be limited at 10% uh, only. Discounted 10% if you order now. Tomorrow, the price will be increased. Thank you. Back to you. Okay, thank you. Tomorrow, the price will be higher. It's a common. <laughs> and I love that. Thanks a lot, Master Asti. <clears throat> okay, next, we will have <clears throat> our next uh, player. Let's just pick our number once again. Okay, is anyone want to volunteer? I'd like to try perhaps and go for number 10. Okay, thank you. Yes, Murtaza, just pick your number. Which one? It's, uh, how about number 10? Number, number 10. 10. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay, number 10. Let's go. Let, let me just stop share for a while. Number 10. Be ready, okay? Okay, let me share this screen. Let's go. Yes, Murtaza Ahad. Sell me this house. This beautiful house. Okay. <clears throat> well, thanks for the topic, Mr. Table Topic Master Ridwan. This is a beautiful house. And I think this is a very exclusive apartment. And one thing that this house has is something which I believe all of us, no matter where we're from, we would love to be someone who has purchased this house. You know why? Because it has seven to eight bedrooms. Eight bedrooms, if you buy it today, we can make an extra one for you. And we can get an extra ceiling done for you, just for you. And you know what is the benefit of that? The benefit of that is you are going to be having something. And that something is you will be having a great time with your family and friends. You know what is also great about this apartment is that you're also going to be having something else which is you're going to be having a badminton court right beside the house. And once when you have that badminton court, you can have a good time with your friends. I mean, imagine the amount of fun you're going to be having. And besides the badminton court, there's also going to be a garden as well. And in that garden, there's gonna be fruits. And we have planted trees, the best trees that you can find and you are going to be having a good time because imagine after playing badminton, you're going to have that fruit. And I have not got, gotten even to the main point, which is the fact that the house inside, it is going to be having many things such as it's going to be having a big TV. It's also 
going to be having a very nice added on bed where you can relax. I mean, if you look at the bed, that alone is enough for you to purchase the house where you can relax and spend time. And then you have this wonderful apartment. If you look at this apartment, I don't think you want to miss the chance of purchasing it. So do purchase it today because we shouldn't wait for tomorrow. Do it now. How about you? Still talking faster. Oh my God. There's so much awesome. I don't think the question. I think the question is very suitable for you. I mean, like you're so talented to be an agent property. <laughs> <laughs> you should try it. <laughs> okay, next we will have our pick our number. Let me share my screen first. <clears throat> okay, for this uh for this time it will be for the offline. So for those of you in the on site, you will have the chance. Is there anyone willing to take the chance? <laughs> Eleos. Okay, Toastmaster Eleos. Let's pick your number, Toastmaster okay, Eleos. Let's pick <clears throat> Okay. Seven and ten is taken. Today is 11. So I uh, Can you repeat that? Because what number? So two, two, two. Two, okay. Let me choose two and let me stop share first. Okay, be ready, okay? Okay. Hey. <clears throat> Tell me this book. How to oh. Okay. <laughs> so, the, the, so, sell me this book, Postmaster Elios. How to love what? How to love what? He said, I, I cannot see it. Only of how to love? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Can you hear me? Clear? Yes. yes. Okay. Go ahead. Oh, okay. I can start now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, uh, Ladies and gentlemen, Filters Masters, you are on the right place. This is the best time to buy this book. Imagine, this is how to love book. Yeah? Yes. I wrote this book and I'm so proud of it. This is the journey of my love. Oh, I found my soulmate. Can you imagine? Not only one, oh. <laughs> not only one time, but several times I got some heartbroken story. I got disappointed. Uh, they ghost me. I ghost them. We. <laughs> we to we should try to comment into a serious business. Because love is a serious business, right? And we do believe on it. So, everyone here, do you bring your offer here? Please raise your hand. No? Nobody will bring your offer here in this Toastmasters meeting. Next time, definitely, you should bring your offer. Because this how to love book is the one that will help you not only to find your love, but to them to come to those master's meeting. Imagine if every single member bring their lover, bring their spouse into the meeting, you would get many members. Well, yes, I am an MLM business fan. <laughs> Nobody so much that if you can bring your spouse, you bring your family, you can bring more members into eagle into those masters and you can help your god as well and that's how to love your friend your family your club yes your those masters right so everybody okay, this book now because tomorrow the price will be go higher and yes if you can find your love now 
no need to find it tomorrow. Thank you, Thank you. Master Elian. <laughs> I, I really love the idea. The Toastmaster would be fine to take me out in Indonesia. So, yeah, we can learn English together and we can find our lover. That would be a great idea. Okay, next we will have our uh, pickup number. Let me just share my screen. Okay, is there anyone willing to try? Okay, uh, how about our guest, Ronawati Wongso, are you there? Uh, Tika, uh, offline yeah. guest. Okay. Oh, yes, Tika. Okay. Yes, Tika. <clears throat> Is it in offline? Yes, it's offline. Okay. Okay. Hello, Gestika. Let's just pick your number. Which number are you going to take? I try eight. Eight. Okay. Let me see. Is eight taken? No. Okay. Eight. Are you sure? Yes. <laughs> okay, let me stop share, uh, stop share screen first. Let's go to the number eight. Okay. Yes, Tika. Sell me this laptop. <laughs> Yep. What is the most important thing uh, when it comes for a laptop? Are you uh, are you choosing the capacity, or are you choosing the memory, or are you choosing the duration, the durability of the battery? So whatever your choice, I'm sure this laptop will uh, fit your needs, and also uh, we have uh, several types of it. So you can choose which one is suitable with your uh, needs and also uh, you can adjust to your budget. So don't miss the chance and uh, because this is a limited edition, so uh, take it now, don't leave it. Okay. And the other, uh, the other benefit is uh, if you have if you enjoy this uh, laptop, we also have a program that you can refer to your friends and you can get the more benefits, like you can have like extra gifts or anything. So um, don't miss this chance and grab it soon. Right? Thank you, Gestika. That's an awesome opinion. <laughs> That's an awesome selling story. It's very technical and yeah, I really like that. Thank you, Gestika. So next, we will have to pick number again. Is there I'm, anyone willing? Okay. I'm ready. Okay, that's Master Ririn. Let me share yeah. my screen. Just pick your number. Uh, one. One. Okay. Let me stop share first. And the one goes to. Tada. Sell me this pen. Okay. Okay. Sell me this pen. Toastmaster um... Ririn. Uh, hello, sir. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, can I have your pen? Or maybe... Uh, uh, I'm sorry. Sorry. Let me start first. Hold on. Oh, okay. 
Uh, hello, everyone. Do you know about this pen? Uh, you can you can check that this pen has a good uh, ink. Uh, they they have a, a various colors like a red, blue, red, uh, red, blue, uh, black, and then they have a green. So you can highlight like everything that you want to make sentence or appointment or sometime like uh, I'm sorry. I think it's enough. <laughs> Hello. Hello. It's all good. Yes, continue. Yes, yes. I'm nervous. <laughs> Uh, I'm nervous. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's totally all right. Uh, is the timer end? Yes. Alvin. Yes. Okay. Thank you so much, Master Irin. That's that's totally fine. I really like the courage that you are having. Yes. Because we are all <laughs> learn here. Yeah. You, you did great job. Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, let's just pick our numbers again. Is there anyone willing to try? In offline, maybe. Yes, Peter. I'm sorry. Yes, yes Peter. 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 Okay. So Peter. So Peter. Oh my God. I feel like today there are a lot of uh, people who want to do public speaking. And it feels great because you are here. Okay, hello, Peter. Okay, let's, my my okay um, let's, uh, let's go to pick your number. Let me share my screen first. Let's go. Let's pick your number. Which number are you? Number three. Number three. Pick number three. Number three. three. Number three. three. Okay, number three. Let me stop share first, and it will be this one. Sell me this car. You. Okay. Can I start now? Okay. Sell me this car. Yes, Peter. Okay. I want to ask you uh, something before I sell this car. Is there anyone here? Have the car. If anyone here doesn't have a car, maybe this car is for you. But this is not an ordinary car. This is a supercar. Maybe uh, all of you cannot afford to buy this. But I think that there, there is someone that money, most money to buy this car. And I want. <laughs> uh, Let's say that this car is uh, not. I don't, I don't, uh, if you don't have uh, money to buy this, you can refer to your friends. Uh, maybe one of your friends have money to buy this car. And and who knows that he needs this car? Uh, it's, if, uh, maybe if your friend is build this car is expensive, maybe I can give you a special price. If you 
uh, I've intended to buy this car uh, today or I will give you a special discount for you. But if you buy this car tomorrow or the next day and the price get to normal, uh, maybe this is your the right time to uh, buy this car as soon as possible before the price getting back to normal. <laughs> that's that's all from me. Thank you, guest Peter. You did such a good job for the first uh, time yeah. being in the uh, being a public speaker because being a public speaker it's hard. <laughs> I experienced that. <laughs> okay, uh, let's just pick our numbers again. Let me share my screen. Okay, is there anyone willing to try? Uh, maybe in online. Toastmaster Eni. Okay, Toastmaster Eni. Online, that's totally okay. I'm nervous right now. <laughs> totally okay. Everyone is I'm nervous. nervous. <laughs> okay, let's just pick your number. Which number are you? <laughs> number two. Number two, wait, 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 let me see. Uh, number two is already taken. So which number left? Uh, wait, wait, six, six, we have four, four, five, six, nine. Um, four. Four. Okay, let me help share first. You got to help me. Okay. <laughs> this is going to be hilarious. Okay. <laughs> I lost <that> any. <laughs> Sell me this motorcycle. You can be as creative as you want. Are you ready, Toastmaster Amy? I'm not ready. <laughs> okay. Okay, mm. tell me this motorcycle, Toastmaster Amy. If your hobby is just like me, um, traveling, you can choose this motorcycle. You can go anywhere you want and you can uh, bring so many stuff and then put in the, what's the name? <laughs> and then you, you can put it in, in the motorcycle. Um, and I think if you want to get an, if you want to engage many followers in Instagram, I I think you you have to take a picture with the pic with the motorcycle. <laughs> then, uh, um, I think this is really good for you to engage men more followers in Instagram and of, of in a Facebook. I think that's all. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, Thank, you. <laughs> Thank you, this Mr. Eddie, for trying. That's a really good, uh, uh, really unique motorcycle because it has two wheels in front. <laughs> but you can bring your stuff in the front. So congratulations, everyone. Let's cheer this session. I really love this session. But uh, for the closing, I would like to have a proper closing for quotes. So let me share this. Everything seems fun when we are trying. So why are you afraid of public speaking now? 
So let's just try exercise more and become a better version of yourself. Thank you, everyone. Back to talk. Thank you, Dr. Master, but I do have to disagree with you because public speaking was never fun for me. But Eagle, make it fun. So thank you, Eagle. And now, can we have the timer's report, please, Dr. Master Alvin? Yes, thank you, Dr. Master Resita. Here is the time report from seven speakers. Uh, six of them are eligible to be voted. Dr. Master Asn Asti, one minute, 19 seconds. Toastmaster Murtaza, two minutes, 13 seconds. Toastmaster Elias, two minutes, eight seconds. Gestika, one minute, 22 seconds. Toastmaster Ririn, 59 seconds, one second shy from being eligible to be voted. Guest Peter, one minute and 55 seconds. Toastmaster Any, one minute and one second. Back to you, Toastmaster Resident. Thank you, that's Master Alpin. And may I call our counter? Are we ready to do the voting, that's Master Ipu? You are still muted, that's Master Ipu. Okay, everyone, um, I will share my screen. Please scan the QR code and I will give you a few seconds to vote. Have you shared your screen, Ms. Master Ipo? And you are still muted again. <laughs> okay. Okay, now we can see that you are started screen sharing. Okay, everyone, please pick your handphone and prepare your QR code scanner and vote for your most favorite table topic speaker from our session before. And I would like to try the technique that our participants have tried. Um, sorry, Master Ipung, I believe that the options are not correct yet because we just have three options in your, I believe you have to save that first. Okay, thank you okay. for the correction. Can we um, see the Okay, everyone, can you share, um, can you uh, scan the QR code again? Okay, now we have the correct options and I would like to try the technique that our participants have tried to like giving the urgency, like if you don't do it now, everything bad, uh, something bad will happen. So if you don't put now, you will not be able to vote your most favorite letter. So take your phone and vote now. As you toast Master Mala and toast Master Michael trying to scan. <laughs> and toast Master Kung, you can also share the link in the Zoom chat box because I believe around one minute has passed. Does anyone find difficulty scanning the QR code or can we proceed to the next session? Proceed. Okay. Thank you. And now let's move on to the next session which is the prepared speech session. In this session, we have one speaker, Tos Master Mala, and Tos Master Mala will have her own evaluator. And for tonight, the evaluator will be our love guru, Tos Master Ilios. So please welcome to the stage, Tos Master Ilios, to introduce our speaker. 
Yeah. Hello. Uh, now I will introduce our speaker today because speaker Mara. The purpose of our project is practice applying feedback and serve as a speech evaluator during a club meeting. And for the member to demonstrate their ability to deliver an effective, respectful speech and evaluation. And here I uh, I get a guidance here to help your evaluator meet your goals, identify at least one change you have made to your speech or delivery based on your first evaluation and feedback project speech evaluation. So with the detail, little things matter, yeah. Malah menurung, malah menurung, little things matter. It is lunch time, and I want to enjoy my lunch peacefully. Suddenly, there are little students who sat next to me. Two students are talking to her friend. Today is my lucky day. My mom prepared a special food for me. I cannot wait to eat it. I was wondering what is inside her lunch box. Her friends too. We are being curious to know what's inside her lunch box. You want to know one? He opened it excitedly with with full of hope. One, two, three. Tada! It's an instant noodle. <laughs> I was so disappointed, staring at each other with her friends. Like, how come only an instant noodle? She becomes so excited. She thinks that it's like a precious thing. Do you think so, fellow Toastmasters? Online and on site? Something that's special for her, maybe because she, she just can eat the instant noodle once a month or only once per three months. So it's special for her. Well, for me, and maybe for all of you, because you are adult, eating is a noodle is not special, right? We can eat it anywhere, every time, whenever it is, when we want it, right? But then I realized from this little struggle, maybe sometimes we didn't realize that something special for people could be only a little for us. Do little things matter? I learned this also from another experience. About a few years ago, my office had a policy. The policy is they gave an allowance to the employee who are wearing glasses. So that is a good amount of allowance so that they, the people can buy nice and fancy glasses. So when my friend heard about this policy, they were excited and shouted, hooray, finally we can have nice pair of glasses. So they asked me to accompany them to come to the shop. Mala, let's go. And I said, okay, I'm going to be happy with the one who's happy. And they are so busy looking at the frame, looking at everything. Oh, this one makes me so beautiful, so attractive and everything. Well, I just sat in the corner of creating them with a full of sad feeling. Why? Because I don't wear glasses. So that allowance doesn't belong to me. It's only for them. But you know what? The shopkeeper is a good seller. Like our team, everybody can sell. So he called me, hey miss, come here. Why didn't you pick the one just like your friend? And I said, no, I don't wear glasses. I said, how come you're so confident? Let's do the test first. Boom, suddenly I see an opportunity to get that allowance. So I did the test, starting from the top to the bottom, trying, hoping that something is wrong with that. 
then finally the shopkeeper said wow, you have normal eyes you know what that was the first time when i heard something good, but it feels like so bitter for me so it's not for me but you know what the shopkeeper is very very intelligent good seller see he asked me again miss if you cannot buy this one how about you want buy sunglasses and i said how come i wear sunglasses in front of my students so i felt like the world is not fair the world is only for the one who has something which i don't have so the envy occupied my heart don't you think it's ridiculous silly right you are feeling angry because of the things that you don't have while other people might think that is very good to have it i thought that my eyes are not special they are only just little things we have all blessing but sometimes and most of the time maybe we fail to notice them. we forgot to appreciate we forgot to respect to even to say thanks for it to be grateful to them. did you realize that each adult here needs to have 550 liters of oxygen every day and if, did you know that some people need to struggle for that in the hospital because they can, they have to be depend on your oxygen and if we convert the five, 550 liter of oxygen to the money it will cost around 13 million 750,000 rupiah so can you imagine that every day you actually spend 13 million 750,000 don't you think that we have a precious life that we can go and we can breathe the oxygen that we didn't realize that oxygen is actually a precious thing that we have is not little things so from this experience from the little students and from the glasses i learned that we cannot compare our life we need to appreciate everything how about feeling that saying that we are appreciating even for the little things that we usually don't count i want to invite you fellow toastmasters and distinguished guests to be gratitude of every little things that we have in our life let's just be the little student who is excitedly open her lunch book and then saying today is my lucky day and i want to enjoy every bite of it back to you toastmaster of the meeting thank you toastmaster mala little things matter count your blessing because you only will be grateful of it once it's gone very insightful from those master mala and let's have our timers report those master alvin okay thank you those master mala is 7 minute and 11 seconds so she is eligible thank you and with that thank you those master alvin and with that our prepared speech session has ended and let's move to the most awaited session our edu session will be led by Toastmaster Michael, an ex-Gojek who have been in sales and marketing for more than seven years. And now he is here to share with us how to sell. So without further ado, please welcome Toastmaster Michael. Oh, sorry, we got a technical problem here. Like the the main Zoom got disrupted. Okay, no worry. Okay, no worry. All right. Yeah, I don't know why. Not my signal. Recording in progress. Ready. You want to? Oh, ini udah. Ada. 
You guys, is it audible? Yes, you are. All right, perfect. Sorry, is it is it the time already? Sorry. Not yet. Okay. Okay. You are back here. Are you having any difficulties getting win or no we are ready? Okay. Ready? When are you? Yeah. Are you, are you uh, Tom? Yes. Is the S Can I start? Yes. Time is yours. Ah, okay. Right. So this is my time already. All right, thank you. Sorry, it, it was missing. Hi, everyone. Good evening. Hello. <laughs> I see a few names. Yeah. No, no, no need. Right. We are still preparing the, sorry. So what are we going to witness this Master Marshall? Will we have like um practice session or will you be sharing tips from your experience? Oh, you are ready now. Yes. Yeah, all right. So uh, thank you everyone and uh, welcome. Uh, I would like to, uh, it's not really a session, but I, I would like to more sharing um, so that we can get the more like uh, chilling and interactive way. If, if you want, you can unmute your microphone and you can jump into the conversation whenever you want to. So just unmute your microphone and just tell, uh, say something or you can put it, put it in the chat. All right, got it? Just checking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did I get some response? Yeah. <laughs> awesome. All right. So uh, today uh, we are we are discussing about daily life sales. Daily life sales. I mean, uh, um, like uh, day to day sales that we usually use in our daily life, whether we we realize it or not. I cannot see you. Oh wait. Yes, all right. Okay. Wow. All right. So today we have two parts. Uh, we will be talking about the factors, and then the part two will be talking about the tactical skills. And if we have more time, we'll be talking about the seven cases that Previously, you have submitted in the group chat only for legal members. So thank you. So before we start, guys, fellow Toastmasters and distinguished guests, sales. I want you to type down one word what you have in mind about sales. For online participants, online guests, I want you to type. And for offline, just tell me. Commission. Sales. Profit. Customers, value, money, negotiate, frightening, money, market, discount, <laughs> bonus, all right, promote, demand, wow, profit, down payment, give it. incentive, uh, rich, oh, nice, deadline, that's why I know. And what is the set? Oh, wow, very good. I love all these answers because uh yes guys you're all all right because like all of these words is actually related to sales and we can see that sales is very really like wide it's various right and now um uh, i want a one volunteer here uh can be from online can be from offline right uh online is okay i think this time we'll go to online yeah 
uh, guys, so uh, you win a free flight ticket to anywhere else in the world that you can choose. So it is up to you. But tell me one reason why you invite you to unmute your microphone. Why you? So you can pitch yourself. Okay, who? Just unmute yourself because I cannot control, I cannot see here. So just, just unmute and tell me why you and where do you want to go? Toastmaster Alvin, yeah. Nah. Yes. Nah. All right. So just pretend that you win a free flight. You got a chance. So this is competition. Oh. So why you that is eligible to be the winner? Oh, why why am I, I eligible? Uh, the yeah, this is like a why are you eligible for this? This is yeah. so this is a competition. Okay, so if you could win a free flight ticket to anywhere else in the world, where you would go? Um, I want to go to Nepal. Hmm. Nepal, interesting. Nepal. Why Nepal and why you? Because I love mountain, so I want to go to the peak of the earth, mountain Everest. And why me? Because uh, the, the the time I go back in Indonesia, I will share you all the story. So hopefully it can inspire you to go there as well. Nice, yeah. You can see that people here are laughing. That means that they agree with you. Thank you. <laughs> what what we'll give the free ticket to you, guys. I'm waiting. Is that real? Uh, <laughs> no, we would love to. So... Uh, ladies and gentlemen, fellow Toastmasters, what uh, Toastmaster Alvin just now did is like a very micro selling. He is actually trying to sell himself why he is eligible. Like this is like the kind of small activities happen in our day-to-day -day life, whether we realize it or not, that we are trying to get something. It is not always like, hey, this is my pen, buy this pen. It's, it is one of the form of selling, yes. But that's not the only selling. Those master Alvin just perfectly demonstrated how he sell himself. So, so that's why those are factors of selling, and there are several factors. Now, I'm really impressed with our with our uh, table topic masters today that he forced everyone here in the room to sell something that we know that something is difficult and i hate selling who one offline we got one who hates selling and from the online does anyone here hate selling okay two those master asita those master mala okay the rest i assume you love selling then yeah hmm mm -hmm. Because it's difficult, right? Yeah. So guys, I, I'm not hating, but I rarely sell. All right. Yeah. So guys, this is, uh, I'm not asking you to sell now, but I want you to give price to this pen. Can you type or on the offline, can you guess how much? Okay. I will, I will uh, wait for your response. We got... 10,000 for those master recipes. Only one, only one piece. All right. One piece of pen. How much? 5,000. 3,000. 3, wow. 3,000. Oh, don't worry. We have those master within 2,500. Oh my God. <laughs> that must be in Shopee. Yeah? Those master Alvin, 10,000. Those master Indra, 5,000. Wow. Those master Indra. Wow, seriously, I will supply you with a pen though. <laughs> you can buy from me only 30,000. <laughs> uh, uh, Toastmaster Ritwan, 10,000. Hey, Toastmaster, any token? 1,000. Where did you get it from? 1,000. Toastmaster, any? Hiya. <laughs> this is pen, Nila. When I was kid, it's already 2,000. Huh? TikTok shop. 
Gomban. Oh, no one, Gomban. So the, the highest is uh, 35,000, yeah? All right, TikTok shop. Oh yeah, TikTok shop subsidy only the first user, All right? Not only for old users. Guys, all right. So do you believe me that, uh, before we proceed, who agree 35,000 is too expensive for this man? One, two, three. 35,000 is too expensive. One, two, three. Uh, for me, yes. For Peru, yes. For uh, for in Sumatra, Elias depends. For Etty, no. All right. Wow. Send the content. The value. Okay. Yes. Those Sumatra Afin, yes, too expensive. Wait, uh, I'll try to read. Koiro, but for those who need it badly, it will be cheap. Mm. Alvin, not if it's a discount. If it is a discount, depends on place or urgency, maybe. Very good. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, this is like, uh, I'm going to share like a very, uh, very, very, very basic, but very important. And I, I already got some answer from you. Come. Hmm. Let's see. If we sell the pen to these kids. So 2,000, no, 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 1,000 that those months of any give me, it will be reasonable, right? Agree, guys? 1,000 is okay. 2,000 is okay. 5,000? Yeah. Elementary students still too expensive, yeah? 5,000. So do we agree that it is expensive? Uh, it is cheap? Oh, yeah. It is cheap because the mother paid for them. <laughs> Parents' money, yeah? Money. So it's cheap, yeah? Privilege, yeah? Perspective. But do we agree that 35000 is too expensive for them? Do we agree that on them? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. How about online? Yes, online, right. But if we look at this, we sell this handsome guy, not this one that I that, that, on the picture. Do you think he will be like, oh, it's too expensive for me, 35,000. It's only $2, it's $2.5. Huh? We're selling dollars, right? Yes, two, two and a half dollars, three dollars, right? So what do you think? He doesn't, exactly, only three dollars. Yeah, only two, two and a half dollars, right? More likely to buy than the students. Very good. So this is the point, the first point that yes, number one is people. So whether we are selling to the elementary students or the professionals, like whom we are selling our pen to. Because we need to know what for the pen. It is like actually mentioned by those masters, what for? If it's only like for ulangan, for homework, it is definitely too expensive. But if it is for signing contract, for example, signing documents in public notary, notary public, for example, it will be okay, right? And also, we need to know we need to know whether they have money or not. For people, for elementary students, if they don't have money, then a five thousand pen will be too expensive. Agree to this point? Yeah? Did the go? Yeah? All right. Cool. Uh, I think the online is still typing, but yeah. <laughs> we don't want to move on, eh? <laughs> now, guys, we are moving again. We continue to sell the pen. But the pen now, regardless who the people are, we sell the pen in that shop. In that shop. Do you think 5,000 is too expensive or 5,000 is okay? Expensive. 5,000, okay, yeah. But 35,000? No, yeah, 35,000. Yeah, expensive. No, no. That's my story. Oh, yeah, yeah, the discount is good. right? Yeah. But what if we bring the pen here? 
Tara. Jamin, yeah. And this shop is actually uh, not my favorite shop because they always mark, uh, mark the price up like twice, twice, like quadruple the price. So I uh, I don't really shop at Promedia, but does it sound more common or more acceptable if they sell it for 35000 compared to the previous one, compared to the previous place, right? Because mm -hmm. Master Rashita, yes. They provide air conditioner, right? They provide air conditioner. They provide the convenience, experience, right? They provide like more things. Another type of well, uh, meaning options, right? Like choices, right? Uh, and music. Oh yeah, and music. True. Uh, yeah. And it is still expensive, like uh, Indra said, but it is still acceptable. But yeah, it is still expensive, yeah. And free seat, uh, limited. And music, oh yeah, free seat, limited, only at, at, at the front of the cashier. Right? So that's why number two, the aspect number two is location. So where do we actually sell our things? It matters. The pen is actually the same. We agree on that, right? I, I don't change the pen, I don't change the picture because I don't have the time to do so. <laughs> so yeah, <laughs> I just put copy the same picture over and over again on the slides. So number number one is people. We need to know uh, what for and whether do they have the money. And number two is location. And if we come back again on Gromedia, we, some of us already agree that yeah, 35,000 is actually acceptable, but this is not the best. Uh, it is not like the best price, right? Agree, guys? Yeah? Now, can you imagine this is the same pen? Again, remember that this is the same pen. Now, I'm asking you to travel to this side. Imagine you are trying your luck and you need to fill your data. You have been queuing for two hours. And then you didn't bring your pen and no one is borrowing the pen for you. But I'm coming here at the corner here, you can see uh, at the corner, I'm telling you, I'm offering you the pen 15,000 or else you will return to your home and get back to the bank. And you need to stop your queue. Like you need to spend two hours waiting again. Will you buy this pen for 35,000? Yes. Right? The pen is actually the same. And the place doesn't have uh the the AC. Order the Gojek. Good idea. Ordering the Gojek. Yeah. It will cost the same, more or less, right? So 35,000, you got the convenience. You got the instant, yeah. instant relief, right? Right, 35,000, you order Gojek, cost more by Gojek, exactly. So if we see whether uh, the uh, the people, am I rich? Am I as rich as the bullet? Yeah. No, right? We back. <laughs> am I as rich as the bullet? Hey, online. No, right? I'm not as rich as the bully. Yeah. And no, I mean, I mean, yeah. They say I'm more rich than the bully. Oh, I mean, yeah. <laughs> and then the second is the place better than Gromedia. There is no AC, there is no uh there is no music, there is no free seating, right? There is no beautiful stuff as well. So what do you, what do you think makes the pants can go higher in terms of price? What do you think? Ur urgency. Urgency. Very good. Anyone has another guess? Urgency. Limited. We only have five. Yeah. Value. Exclusive value. Exclusive. Very good. 
uh, efficiency. Very good. Yes. Trending, uh, what? Trending brand. Yeah, because uh, there is no options, right? In Gramedia, there are lots of options and here no option. Package. Uh, here, there is no package. Uh, it's just uh, a la carte, only one. But yes, it is packaged uh, in the, it is packaged in the, like in the shop, like in the institution, usually the government institution, right? This, this, this typical. You are all all right, guys. You're correct. That the, the other thing important is the timing. So people location timing, meaning that efficiency, the packaging, the urgency, it, it is because of the timing. So these three factors are impacting the price of the goods that you sell. It is not the only three factors, not only these three, but these three are uh, playing uh, important roles. So uh, part two is the tactical skills. Tactical skills is uh, the uh, like the skills that uh, everyone should have. Yeah, two minutes, twenty minutes go by, and, and this is only the part two. Yeah, I know thirty minutes is too uh, too short. I know. All right, I'll go faster. Tactical skills, guys. So I would like to introduce the smart selling. Smart selling is uh, the thing that we use uh, in like uh, I've been working in several companies and. Every company has different approach, but in general, this is what uh, what made me sell more than two thousand dollars for only English courses for Surabaya, Surabayan people. So for people in Surabaya, we sell like courses like tiga puluh juta, tiga puluh dua juta only for learning English, non official. So uh, what I what I conclude from the process is the smart selling system. What is smart selling system? The first is S for Sapa. So the first time uh, we meet the customers, we need to Sapa. We need to say hi and smile. Hi, don't forget to give the smile because smile instantly bound, uh, build the relationship between you and the customers. So that's what we have been doing. We always say hi and smile. So Sapa. And then number two is M, Mengali, digging. Digging, we need to know the background of the people and then what does he need and the motives why he buy the product or why he needs the, the help from us. So this is digging, M, Mengali. And then the third is A, Analisa, analyze. So we need to analyze what at what problems do they actually have? And what the solutions that we have through our product that might benefit them. So we analyze. So where, while we were talking to the prospect, actually our, our Pantheon processors here, like, like analyzing. So that's behind the scene, guys. And then the next is responsive. And responsive. Responsive meaning that uh, we we be we become responsive and reply and try to assist whatever they ask and whatever they uh, they need to know further. We always give the response. And then the T is transaction. Many of us, whenever when it comes to the transaction time, we 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 are about to get the money. We feel like wait 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 later lah. You think think first, yeah. It's not yet. It's not yet. You think first. You go home and then come. Call me if you already sure. Call me. Call me. It's not good, guys. Because if the prospect already sure with their decision, you just do the transaction. Okay, sir. Now you transfer to this account. Okay, sir. May I get your payment? Okay, sir. This is the goods. Thank you. And may I receive your payment? So this is the transactions. Because selling is not getting or robbing their money without anything. Selling is exchanging the value and we are trying to give solution to their problem. So many, many sales that in my team failed is in this, in this section, in this part. They feel like hesitant to get the payment. Like, mm, should I really get his money? Yeah, 
It is, yes, because you are selling, yes. So just do the transactions anyway, because you are solving their problem. So do it now. Any question this far? I already uh, finished the part two. I want to uh, leave some time for discussion and questions. Right? I'll go through. Now study case. Uh, this is your time, guys. Uh, I want I want uh, I want to challenge uh, online and offline guests to analyze from our first part to analyze people, location, and timing. All right. I'll provide a guess. Uh, I will provide a study case, and I invite you to unmute or type on the chat. Type on the chat is okay. Type in the chat is okay. Yeah. See, this is the uh, the first. Product Toastmaster membership <laughs> and the target is people who need to improve their skills. Okay. <laughs> I need you. <laughs> All right. So I need you to analyze from uh, from people, from the location. So from the people first, who do you over? And then from the three, yeah. And then from the uh, location, where do you offer it? And from the timing, where? Hmm. After this meeting, yeah. Closing, closing, yeah. Just for fun. If I. We're uh, while waiting, yeah, I'm still waiting for some answers. So for me, Toastmaster membership, for me, if I were to be the VPM, so Toastmaster membership is something that's beneficial because Toastmaster membership is only like uh, 2 million per year at Eagle Toastmasters, 2 million per year, uh, and you already got like 11 pathways that you can choose from. So it can be like a presentation mastery, or you can be the persuasive selling, or you can be the humorous speech, for example. So uh, you're a humorous uh, speaker, and there are like a few options that you can choose. So among uh, those 11 uh, pathways, you can choose one, pick one, and then uh, you will deliver your project. So from one project, usually there are few uh, assignments, and there are five levels in one pathway. For example, I took coaching. So in, in coaching, I need to take one coach, one man coaching. And I need to like coach and I need to share to the group. And I will be evaluated. Like today, uh, Toastmaster Mala will be evaluated by Toastmaster Alliance. And there will be progress that will be observed by, uh, in this case, in our Eagle Toastmaster, you will be observed by Toastmaster Resita as Vice President of Education. She will be taking care of your progress, like day per day. Uh, it depends on your level. And you need to take the role as well. So, for example, you learn to be grammarian. Not everyone dare and want to be the grammarian because grammar is like very scary. You need to like take notes like the grammar mistakes, like you need to be very careful, but that's it. And sometimes you need to be the MC, the postmaster of the meeting. So these kind of uh, roles uh, will, will give you the best experience in this one year, only for two million. And if you uh, enroll now for all case online on site, there will be special promo. So guys, look, I just demonstrated three aspects. The people I in uh, I pros I do the marketing or the selling to all the prospects here because I'm sure that they are interested in Toastmaster in any way, maybe in public speaking or in maybe in improving their English or maybe in the education. I don't know, but in education is the product of Toastmaster as well. And the second location I do my selling just now in Toastmaster. Uh, in Toastmaster meeting, which is like the perfect place to do the pitching. And then the third, the timing, this is the timing because the timing here is like people just experience the meeting. We are in the meeting and I am selling, actually doing the selling. And this is the perfect timing and I will make more uh, wonderful events, I'll make it more engaging by giving discount. Toastmaster with one here, hi Toastmaster with one, are you here? Yes. Yes. Um, yeah. one. Yes. Yeah. Do we have special promo for anyone? Yes, because our topic today is selling. Do we have any special promo? Uh, yes. Yes. Yeah. 
All right. Don't forget to follow up of our of our guest today. Three offline offer our special promo that we have discussed today. Okay, only for today's special offer. All right. So okay. this is timing. All right. Okay. This is timing, guys. So next second, and this is be, be the closing because it's already green. Online writing course for newbie writer who doesn't know how to monetize their skill. Any feedback? Anyone who want to try? And I will give the feedback. No? No one? No one? No one? Gak usah. Kalau nggak ada yang mau, ya nggak usah jualan. Jangan dimikir. Karena kalau makin banyak orang bisa jualan, uh, if, if there are more people who can sell, selling becomes more difficult, ya. Yeah? Competitors, it's difficult for me then, <laughs> because no one, uh, no one doesn't want, no one want to sell. Then it's easier for us to perform well because no, no competition, right? Oh, it's already right, guys. It's already right. Yay! It's time, up. Hey, I'm sorry, the connection is bad. Yes, all right. So, guys, thank you. <laughs> But this is will be like it's already right, guys. So anyway, I'm here at Eagle Toast Master Club. Uh, feel free to if you wanna like uh, discuss more further and sharing. Uh, I'm far away from perfect, but this is like uh, what we've been doing for the past seven years, and and it works uh, relatively well. And hope uh, this can be beneficial for you. And so thank you so much and welcome to Eagle Toast Master to all offline and online guests. Yay! Give round of applause for them. Thank you. Yay! Thank you, Toast Master Michael. Okay. What I got from Toast Master Michael presentation is selling is not robbery. Because sometimes when you have to sell well for my case, I feel like I'm robbing people because I sell something that maybe they don't need or I feel they don't need it. But maybe it's not that case. Maybe it's just the people is not right or the location where I sell it is not right or maybe the timing. So yeah, maybe I should consider selling sometime. <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Master Michael. And with that, let's we move to the very last session that is the evaluation session. And I will need the help of our general evaluator to lead the session. So please welcome to Master Indra. Thank you, Toastmaster Master Resita. Now it's the time for the past session is for the evaluation session. And the first evaluation is brought by our prepare speech evaluators, uh, Toastmaster. Eleos. Yeah, that's my Eleos. Yeah, yeah, Can you hear me? I just want to make sure. Yes. If I start. Okay. Yes. 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 For the first purpose, practice applying feedback and serve as a speech evaluator during a club meeting. There's a box here. And let's put a thick one here. Speak about the For the members to demonstrate their ability to deliver an effective, respectful speech evaluation. Hey, there's another box here. And let's put two thick here. Two purpose of this project. Thank you. Uh, okay. And from your first evaluator, from your first evaluator, she mentioned that your hand gesture is very good, and I'm observing. I think this time you feel it better. You have done it better. But if you can provide me the first evaluation. I can adjust and evaluate based on that. So I can know how good you are. 
from before and after. And for the facial expression, I'm loving it. Your facial expression here really match the timing. I'm practicing right now how to make the timing, the pacing. Either I'm not too slow like this and to spar like this. And also the standing up. Wow. Yes. I uh, I think you perform on the on site and uh, offline uh, online there and you're standing up right here. But this case you have offline. So I think you have to post your own confidence here and you seem like you are more enjoying now than before. For the utilizing screen, I think because we have the audience here also, uh, the utilizing the screen on the there is also good. And the structure, I know that you have the structure opening body and conclusion uh, and closing. And the personal story is very inspiring and entertaining. I can get into your story. Thank you, Mara. And you are using the descriptive word, and you engage the audience, and the story itself is relatable. And I want you to work on bring your audience on site here and on online here by asking them some questions and give some policy. So you will make them into the story. <clears throat> and the general itself from the first emulator, she said that quotes, you can choose it to make it into your story. And yes, uh, I think you can use, uh, you can print the quotes that maybe the two things matter in your story, and you can put on your prop and you can show it to your audience here or audience here. So it's like a brand. Your quotes, the things matter, it shows to all of your audience. And yes, I think it's right there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Toastmaster Eleos. Now it's the time for our sorry, our timers report. Yes, already okay. Uh, Thank you. Yeah, Eleos is three minutes and one second, so he is eligible. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Now, next is our grammarian, which is Toastmaster. Purwanto. Yes, this Master Purwanto, please share your report. Okay, um, today I would like to give the report about the grammar and during the speeches from the beginning from the table topic, prepare speech and education, and we have the conversation session. There's no mainly uh, grammar error that I found during speeches. And I only want to point for a few things. For example, uh, you can silent. You can silent. I don't think silent is like a verb. So you can be silent. I think that's the right one. And the other one is like, you will have You will have or you will be happy. So remember the structure in English uh, sentences, we have the subject, verb, and also the object. So for the subject, he see it, and the verb is like, yeah, we also have like the model, but you need the verb must be like to be a uh, study or something like that, the action. So you cannot have like, you will have it. You will be happy because having is a gerund. It's not easy to explain all the thing in speaking <laughs> because I believe uh, it's not that easy for everyone to follow. So you will be happy or you will have that stage here as well. The price getting back to normal. Um, same as before, missing something in between because the price is the noun or subject getting is like working or yeah. So you need B to B. 
the price is getting back to normal, for example. Now, uh, sometimes with English, we need to balance all the nouns, all the action, uh, adjective, or etc. So I found someone say anywhere, every time. So it's like if you want to use any, please use any, 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 anywhere, anytime, every time, everywhere. That's the balance. The envy occupied. What's wrong with this sentence? The emptiness. I believe the emptiness. Because envy is like, I feel empty. I feel happy, for example. So the emptiness occupied, for example. Because you need the subject, the noun. I also found uh, maybe Indonesian or maybe Asian people like to tend to times in things in Asian language, Asian culture. So we need to always uh, remember about the time because what's unique about the English in uh, the English culture, the English language is about the time. We have past, present, and future. So when you say something, your hand is blah, 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 is something like, oh, you want to tell people it's happening right now. But if it's something already happened in the past, your hand was shaking, for example, so people know, even though, even though you don't mention about the time, five minutes ago, like one year ago, so people already know that happened in the past. So as I said before, I like us to encourage ourselves, to push ourselves to think about the time. I also found some uh, good phrases. For example, we have all the blessing, but we fail to appreciate it. From our uh, speaker, Mala, and also the other one, to be grateful for all little things. I think that's all from me. I don't, uh, I hope I don't give too many things to confuse you all. But this little information can you we can really help all of us. I think that's all from me back to G. Thank you, those master for one to such a fair util and he gives us uh, example for our better usage. Okay, next is our ah counter is those master Refi. Those master Refi, please. Okay, I will share my screen. Can you see my screen? Yes. Okay, I will make a conclusion from your lexical words and also non-lexical words. From TM Asti until TM Michael, you say so, and also, and, and most of all the speakers here from the request speaker and also the education session speaker speak about and, and so, and also well. And I will make a note about the repeated words. The first is from guest Peter, you say that from like twice and also um and also uh. And then, the Emery Rain, you say a uh, twice. And then the M. Michael, last time you said very, very twice. This is from me back to the GE. Thank you, Toastmaster Refi. Next, it is my time to give uh, the overall evaluations should we take a group picture first or just proceed the general oh. evaluation we will take it later i think okay 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 now i will start to my evaluation for this meeting first thing first is this master of the meeting I, will, uh, I really like uh, Toastmaster Resita to explain the theme, explain the agenda very well. And then she also give 
the give the transition from table topic to prepare speech, for example, to session to session uh, very smoothly. Also, what I like to uh, again about the Toastmaster Resita is give valuable comment after edu session, which capture valuable lesson, uh, lesson. And I still remember about selling is not robbing. Yeah. And I think that is very important. And the uh, improvement, maybe the timing is a little bit exceeded, especially for table topic. Maybe the master Resita could intervene a bit about this. And then next is uh, Grammarian, Toastmaster Purwanto, giving very detailed, giving uh, example for uh, better usage. And I would like to see Toastmaster Purwanto to remind us for using word of the day more frequently. And next is our counter. Uh, it is very detailed as well, giving us a uh, lexical and non-lexical uh, counter. And thank you for being the active listener uh, throughout the meeting. And then for the timer, Toastmaster Alvin, I really like him when he gave the actual uh, count countdown and giving reminder in the chat box, especially when uh, the edu session is uh, conducted 20 minutes, 25 and 30 minutes. I really like that. And also then is table topic master. Thank you for giving us the topic is very, very relevant to the team and giving uh, very simple picture yet easy to understand. Also giving small comment after each speech, which is uh, the speaker is uh, felt listened. And also giving encouraging comments to the speaker that uh, so that they do not uh, discourage. And for improvement, I would like to see next for Toastmaster Ridwan to use slideshow more smoothly. Maybe you can use hyperlink to your Canva so that you cannot uh, you, you do not have to be back and forth, back and forth to screen and stop the screen uh, screen share. And also next is Toastmaster Eleos for giving the very detailed and practical, also give examples of uh, improvement for uh, prepared speech speaker. Overall, uh, I really like uh, to see uh, this meeting again because the timing is, I think it's almost perfect. The starting is on time. It's uh, seven o'clock. Even it opens 13 minutes before. And then the technicality, even though this is a hybrid meeting, I think it's going very great, especially the, the, the voice, the camera, the camera. It doesn't have any problem at all. And then the housekeeping is uh, explained very clear in the beginning. And like remind reminder of changing uh, the name of each uh, participant to match each role. And I'll also I like the, the way that uh, the the member uh, welcoming the guests and introduce uh, briefly about what is Toastmaster. And also, last but not least, edu session is uh, spicing up the meeting so that we can hold our attention uh, more, 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 more time. And for improvement, I think it doesn't hurt to see the table topic evaluator. Uh, although I, 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 I do not have control for the role that takes place in Eagle Toastmaster. And the timing is a bit exceeded, but I think it's very, very good. Thank you so much. Thank you, GE Toastmaster Indra, for your evaluation.
and feedback and also for reminding me to take the picture because we haven't taken a group photo so for online attendees please open up your camera because we will take group photo but and for wallet counter prepare your presentation because after this we will have to give the word to the most favorite table topic speaker and also evaluators and on site would you come to the front of the stage please Toastmaster Ririn, Toastmaster Alvin, we cannot see your face just yet. And also, I would also like to thank the on-site team because without them, we cannot have this hybrid. And they, yes, they truly prepare this very smooth. <laughs> Ya. Bagi, ya. Dua, bagi dua satu di kamera Mala satu di kamera Michael lupa aku nggak ya. oke One. Okay. Another one, please. Another one, please. Because Master Alvin is just getting ready. In three, two, one. Okay. Thank you, everyone. Oh, this Master Ririn just open her camera. One more, one more, one more. <laughs> three, two, one. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. And now, oh, ulan, ulan. All right, all right, ulan. Three, two, one. Okay. <laughs> Who is that? Oh, that's Indra. Ooh. Thank you. And now, let's get to see the winner, Toastmaster Ipung. Are you ready? All right, guys, so it's time for me to announce who is the winner for um, Table Topic Speaker, Prepare Speech, and the favorite evaluation. Okay, the first one, the most favorite Table Topic Speaker goes to... <laughs> The um, Elios, you are the winner of the day. Take Congratulations for you. Oh, two. Okay, smile to Santa Elias. One. Eh, eh. <laughs> Where are you going? One, two, three. Okay, then. All right, congratulations, TMLOS. <laughs> okay, the next one, the most favorite prepared speech goes to. In three, two, one. Ta da! Congratulations to TMLA. You are the winner. I'm surprised. <laughs> Wait a minute. In three, two, one, click. And then. All right. So the last, the most favorite evaluator goes to TM Indra. I think you mean to Master Ilyas. Oh yeah, sorry. Wait a moment. All right. To Master oh. Ilyas got two awards tonight. Itu 
Oh, no. <laughs> two books <laughs> in his hand. In three, two, one. Okay, thank you, Tanzatar Ilyas. I, I, I see also Tanzatar Ilyas is very passionate about selling a book. And with that, thank you, Toastmaster Ipung, for the awards. And thank you. We have come to the end of this meeting. I hope you all enjoy this. And as your MC or Tom, I give the control back to the presenting president, which is also me. <laughs> and okay, I would like to say. Um, I would like to give the opportunity to our visiting Toastmasters to share their upcoming meeting schedule in the chat box because we have Toastmaster, visiting Toastmaster from various clubs here. Toastmaster Indra, our GE from Hand Toastmaster Club, Toastmaster Ririn from Plaza Toyota Toastmaster Club, and also Toastmaster Alvin from SCBD Toastmaster Club. And also, I would like to have some, maybe a word of two or two from our guests, Tika and Peter, right? How how do you feel having your first table topic session? Because was, oh, I'm sorry, guest Tika and guest Peter. Maybe would you come to the stage, please, once again? Both of you? Yeah, please, please. <laughs> Yep, you are visible now. So how do you feel when you are called to be the table topic speaker? You yep. were surprised at the first time. Because uh, Professor Michael Ari challenged me to put me to talk about the topic. <laughs> And I answered the challenge. And how about and you? Where do you know our club? Is it us you? The club, uh, the club is uh, very good for us to improve public speaking. Mm -hmm. but, yes. But uh, even we speak English, uh, we can we not but we, we cannot speak in public like uh such such this club. That's what I learned from this community. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh yes, feel feel great with you. Thank you, thank you, Peter. And how about you, Tika? You seem very confident before. Uh, actually, uh, this is the second time I joined the club. Mm. Previously, it was like, the offline session because during the pandemic. And today, I enjoy the offline session. Yeah. But my problem is like, uh, given the topic and then have to speak. Yeah. So, we need more practice, I think. Thank you for our guest. Yes, if you think you need more practice, then I think it's a very good time to become a member. Because maybe one thing that you haven't known is it's very cheap to become a Toastmaster member. It's just like two cups of Starbucks every month. And other thing is the price actually will go up by July or August, I believe, right? And it's official from Toastmaster. So if you want to become a member, do it fast before the price go up. And it's not a lie, it's a real thing. And thank you. And if you want to become a member, you can contact our vice president of membership, Toastmaster Ritwan, or just any member of the club that you feel more comfortable to. So thank you, guests. And also, hello, Annie. And you, we have <laughs> Annie is our was our member and then he left the club. she left the club but come again to our club because once you fell in love with Toastmaster you will never be able to leave it. 
Okay, thank you everyone. I hope you enjoy the meetings. With that, I will close the meeting. Eagle Club, Eagle Cosmos Club, Club number 01337733 is adjourned. Thank you. Have a good time in the offline or online. I hope to see you in the next meeting, by the way.